guys, I want to show you my makeup. We're going to the Nutcracker Ballet tonight, and I'm about to film as well. So I'm wearing the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Redness Correcting Cream as my foundation, and then the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in vanilla. I'm going to put these away as I talk about them because I'm kind of in a rush. Um, then I use the Anastasia Contour Palette, just the highlight shades on the top there to set my under eye. And then for my contour, I used my Chocolate Soleil Bronzer from Too Faced. For my blush, I'm wearing this NYX blush for the first time in Ethereal. Ethereal. Really pretty, more cool toned pink with some shimmers. And then for my highlight, I pulled out my Laura Mercier highlight in number, shade number one. And for my eyes, I used my color tattoo from Maybelline. As you can see, it's pretty much gone almost, just it's around the rim. This is bold gold. And then I used my chocolate bar palette, which I absolutely love, and I don't know why I don't use it more. Um, so today I used this shade here in my crease, which I think is salted caramel. Let me make sure. Yeah, salted caramel in my crease with this shade here, which is milk chocolate. And then, sorry if I sound sniffly, my nose is kind of congested. This gold all over the lid, which is creme brulee. And then I used marzipan in the inner corner. Um, I think that's it. Oh, no. I also used this shade here, this darker one in my outer V, which is hot chocolate. And um, for my mascara, I used the Hourglass Film Noir Mascara as well as Marc Jacobs Blacker Mascara. For my liner, I used the It Cosmetics in the Black Brown. This is like super blurry for some reason. Well, you get the point. And then for my lips, I used this It Cosmetics lipstick in Love Story. Oh, the Hourglass, I just used this to set my the rest of my face other than my eyes in dim light, which is that baby right there that has a lovely nail chip in it. <laughs> and here's what it looks like. Um, I did also curl my hair. I need to put some agave oil in it too. But I used my Numi Magic Wand, the 19 millimeter, to get these curls. Which I love my Numi wands because every time I use those, my curls will last a couple days. And I'm kind of lazy when it comes to doing my hair. So that's always a plus. Um, I love this color. Okay, so when I first put this on, um, it's more of like a pink like this. But as it adjusts to your natural pH in your um, lips, then it adjusts to like your perfect shade. So some people might not like that, but I already knew that it was going to be more like reddish pink when I put this on. So I love these lipsticks. You guys know I love it, cosmetics. Okay, so I'm going to go get finished getting ready. Then I'm going to film a giveaway, another one for the holidays. It's going to go up December 6th. And then I'm going to head out to go to the Nutcracker. So... Something kind of sad happened. My poor mom, Mama B, she had like a toothache really, really bad and it got real swollen. She apparently needs a root canal and um, it's the weekend so no one can do it and her face is like swollen. And she was supposed to go to the Nutcracker with me and my brother and she can't go. And um, I was like so, so sad and she's really sad too that she can't go because it's our tradition to go every year. Um, and then I asked like a, f a couple friends and my aunt and my grandma like no one can come So I think we're just gonna have to forfeit one of the tickets and me and my brother are still gonna go though So it's kind of a big bummer, but you know, what are you gonna do? Uh, my brother still wants to go so we're gonna go I'm gonna go have dinner with them and then at the house and then I'm gonna take my brother to go to the Nutcracker. Hey guys So I just wanted to quickly show you I'm wearing the anthropology shirt. I got recently my snowflake earrings, this bracelet from, I got it from a boutique, this Tiffany and Co. ring that my mom got me from the Gatsby collection last year. Um, I changed my lip, it's still a cosmetics, but it's the pretty woman color. It just went better with my, um, you know, maroon kind of shirt. The other one was too pink. And then I'm also wearing this purse, I think it's called Bag Ink is the company that makes this. 
and it has like a burgundy color in the inside you can't really see right now and yeah I'm on my way to my parents now Okay, really bad lighting. I'm home in my PJs already. <laughs> um, but I just wanted to let you guys know that the Nutcracker was awesome. Um, me and my brother just ended up going. Mom Mabia is still pretty swollen, but she's doing a little better. Um, they gave her like antibiotics and Vicodin. <laughs> Oh yeah, like it in. <laughs> so she's she's doing a little better, but she definitely is gonna have to go and get that fixed. Um it's like a weird shadow. There we go. Um yeah, so it was just me and my brother, but still was fun. Still got to do our tradition. And I did get an ornament. It was only five dollars, and it's this really pretty nutcracker girl. Not nutcracker ballerina <laughs> and I hope you can see but she has like glitter all on her she's only five dollars so I thought she would go on my tree really beautifully and I actually broke one of my ornaments that I had gotten the year prior that was like the snow flake queen or the snow fairy queen or something um, dancer and she was a ballerina and she was so pretty and her leg broke um, in the move so I didn't find one that was like her, but that's sort of like her replacement, not really. I'm still going to be on the lookout for one like her. And now I'm going to go ahead and edit a video that I filmed today, and then I work tomorrow, 3 to 9. So yeah, that's it for now. For my foundation, I'm using a sample from Hourglass, the Hyaluronic Skin Tint in Warm Ivory, which I really, really love this foundation. Also wearing the NARS um, concealer brightening concealer. Um, for my highlight, I'm wearing this What's Up Benefit highlight. This is a little sample size. I like it better because I like the applicator better on the mini size. So I used that first. And let's try to get this back on with one hand. <laughs> and then I also use the skin, I don't, it's not a skin finish, what's it called? Powder Palette Mineral Glow Pearls in Translucent Pearl from Physicians Formula. For my bronzer, Too Faced Chocolate and then for my blush, I'm using the Alverde blush in Flamingo. For my eye look, I'm using this Smashbox palette. Again, I used it's the Wonder Vision palette. The silver right where my finger is there, all over my lid. And then these two blues back here in the outer corner. And some blending shades back there for my crease a little bit. I also use my Lorac 3D Liquid Luster Drops. Um, just on the center and first third of my lid. For my lip, I used my Hourglass Liner in Lip Liner and Voice from Hourglass, which is much more of a, almost like a pink, oh, where'd it go? There it goes. <laughs> it's more of like a pinky brown, almost Kylie Jenner lip, but then we have to wear purple on our lips, so I... I wanted to use this, but it's super bright, so I muted it down by using that lip liner first, and then used a very small amount of this on top. It's the Too Faced Melted Lip in Melted Violet. And don't pay attention to my crazy hair, because I need to brush it out and maybe recurl it a little bit, but this is my eye look. I like it better than the other day, because I think it's a little bit less crazy on the top here. It's a little bit more controlled of a smoky eye, and the lip's kind of fun. What do you think? It's different. I don't, wouldn't always wear this with a smoky eye, but I really like that highlight too. It's like, ba bam highlights. <laughs> hey guys, I got some new items in gratis from Sephora. If you're new, gratis is just free product I receive for working at Sephora to, you know, be able to recommend them to clients. So first off is the Diva Curl line. They give us the No Poo, which is their Zero Lather Conditioning Cleanser, the conditioner, um, their Ultra Creamy Daily Conditioner, and the Light Defining Gel. So if you're a natural curly girl like I am, this is supposedly a really good line to define curls and be frizz free. So I'm really, really excited to try that. Also got this Bliss Triple Oxygen Instant Energizing Eye Mask. This usually comes in a pack of three or four. You squeeze this little liquid here. It disperses into this area where the pads are. It, you know, saturates them, and then you put them under your eyes for 15 minutes, and it helps to brighten and depuff your under eye. So I've been wanting to try these forever. So very excited about that as well. Then got the Josie Marin Coconut Watercolor Cheek Gel A. 
in the color Getaway Red. Um, I did go ahead and swatch that for you. It's right there on the top. And it's a very pretty stain. I'm not usually a girl that likes to wear liquidy products like this on my cheek, but I'll give it a try. We also received a Laura Mercier Smooth Finish Flawless Fluid Foundation. I was matched in the shade Macadamia, and I'm really, really hoping that it matches me because um, this is a very beautiful foundation. I've used it on clients before. It's a very satin matte. Good coverage, very lightweight, so maybe I'll have to do a full review on that once I try it out. Another product I'm pretty excited about is this um, IGD Triple Remedy from First Aid Beauty. It is supposed to brighten and deep puff and smooth the under eye. It is an eye cream, but it has a metal applicator, as you can see here, that helps the depuffing process. And it has a salmon-y color, so that helps to kind of eliminate a little bit of under circles. So I'm super excited to try this out. I'll let you know what I think soon. Then I got some lip products and a lot of them are red. Um, Sephora loves to give us red. but um, And I don't wear a lot of red, that's why I say it like that. But I did really love this color. It's from Sexy Mother Pucker, or it's from um, Soap and Glory. But the brand, um, the actual title of the lip gloss is Sexy Mother Pucker Lip Liqueur. And this is in the shade Charm Offensive. And it's that really beautiful pinky nude. It's very opaque for a lip gloss. And this is plumping as well. So I'm crazy excited again about that. Then we got these little Buxom Minis. Um, one is a red. It's called Provocateur. And then the nude is called Nudist. And I believe that they have these in their regular line as well, um, in bigger sizes. But this is like the holiday set in the gold limited edition packaging. Um, nudist is that peachy kind of nude. And then the one right next to it is Provocateur. Lots of reds as you can see. <laughs> the next red, um, I love this formula of Stila Lipstick, so I'm very happy to have this. This is the Stila what's it called, Color Bomb Lipstick in the shade Ruby. And it's the second one to the left here. You can see there's great moisture in these and they smell kind of minty, which I really like. And then the last thing is kind of random. We just got Hello Kitty back at the store again, like the collection from Hello Kitty. So they gave us this little lip. It looks like a really bright red, but it's actually pretty sheer. It's like a red bomb. I actually had to build it up pretty, probably like five or six swipes before I got this color all the way to the left here. So I guess this is something I would probably wear if it doesn't, as long as it doesn't have a funny taste to it, because I like a wash of red sometimes as like a natural red color. Doesn't have any name on it or anything, not that I can see. Let's it's see. It's in the shade Cheeky Red. And they're their Plush Pout Lip Balm. So it is a balm that's just like, you know, a stain. So there's all my gratis. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing that. I'm about to wrap a bunch of gifts and watch the holiday. It's one of my favorite Christmas movies. So I just finished wrapping a bunch of presents. The ones that are like the multicolor are going to my parents and then these are going under my tree here. Um, and I have to ship some of these off too. I need to grab, I need to get some bows because as you can see none of them have like little bows on them. And I forgot to buy some bows. I love this wrapping paper, it's so pretty. I love the snowflakes. I got both these in the dollar spot. I actually got that snowman and the polka dot one in the dollar spot like two years ago. Hey guys, don't pay attention to my makeup because it's pretty much non-existent. But I just wanted to check in with you. I've been super productive today. I did laundry, I did dishes, I wrapped presents. I picked up my mail, which doesn't, picking up the mail doesn't sound productive, but for me it is because I don't do it often enough. Like I don't do it every day. Um, took out the trash, <laughs> that's real productive for me too. And 
Now I'm off to my P.O. box. I'm gonna check my P.O. box and then also I have to mail three packages. One is my giveaway package and from my thankful for you giveaway. And then I have two little um, goodie packages I'm sending out to friends. One is to Kristen from Kristen K Channel and one is to Sadie from Sadie Kins 21 here on YouTube. It was, it's kind of her belated birthday gift. It's like really belated I think it's like two weeks late but I'm still gonna send it out today and then mama B got her tooth fixed semi fixed it had an infection so she still has to go back in six weeks to get it completely fixed um, but she's in a lot of pain so I feel so bad that she's you know not feeling the best so I'm gonna go over there maybe make her dinner or something I don't know so and I think I'm also going to go to my storage unit to see if I have any bows from last Christmas because I feel like I do. I just forgot to grab them from the storage when I got all my Christmas decor. So yeah, that's the plan for today. If I do or see anything interesting, I will show you. I just got super excited. Do you see how beautiful the colors and the trees are over here? We normally do not get that, so that's why I'm super excited. Isn't it so beautiful? I know probably everyone else on the East Coast is like, um, all of our trees are that beautiful. Hey guys, Mama B got the iPhone 6 Plus yesterday for her Christmas present to herself. And she got this cute Kate Spade case, but I wanted to show you it because I wish I could show you my phone next to it. Oh, maybe I shouldn't show you. Oh, you little <laughs> shit. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd just show you what it looks like. It, it, it fits in my hand, but it's really big. I still like mine better. I like it. It's like I have the six, tablet. and she has a six plus. Yeah, she wanted it because she likes. I don't know. She doesn't. You don't do a ton on your phone though, but she likes but it to I be. But I will now because yeah. now it's bigger. Oh, that's good. Yeah. So yeah, I just thought I'd show you really quick. Hey guys, you can't see Harley, but he's down there. <laughs> Me and Harley are taking a walk, and this is my grandparents' house. My grandpa does the lights every year. I think he does such a good job thought I'd show you. We're just visiting him now. One of my Black Friday packages came in today. Yay! This is the Victoria's Secret one, obviously. This tote is actually really, really big. It's like a weekender bag, and I love it with the pink sequins and the big VS in the front. Um, it's a really nice quality tote. So I have all my goodies inside of here. Give you a little sneak peek. But I'm gonna film a Black Friday haul and Cyber Monday haul, and so once everything comes in, then I'll film it. Good morning. Um, I didn't show you my makeup because it's exactly the same as it has been for the last week and a half, because um, I have to wear this look for work. Um, so I use that Smashbox Wonder Vision palette again, my Lorac Luster Drops for my eyes. And my lip is Anna from NARS Audacious Lipsticks. I love it. It's always sold out at my work too. Um, I wanted to talk to you guys really quick this morning. By the way, I washed my hair and straightened it last night. So that's why it probably looks better than it usually does. <laughs> um, a lot of you were like, are you going to do Vlogmas? I really want you to do Vlogmas. And I really wanted to do it too, but because I don't have a separate vlog channel, like I do my beauty videos and my vlogs on my same channel, I feel like that might be annoying to some that don't watch my vlogs to have the video like every single day of a vlog because I know I would if I did that every single day, I wouldn't have time to film any beauty videos really. Um, and if I did, it'd be very, very minimal. I don't know if all of you know this, but I do post beauty videos on Wednesday and Friday, and then Sunday every week is my vlog. And I usually try to post in the very early morning, so they're always up like the entire day. So I'm kind of doing Vlogmas because I already vlog every single day. I just won't post it every day, you know? I'll only post it on Sunday. But if you guys really, really want that, I, it probably is too late now since I'm already three days into um, December, because you're supposed to do, Vlogmas is vlogging every day up until Christmas, so 25 days of vlogs. Um, if you guys really want me to do it, maybe I'll do it next year. If if all, a lot of you are like, yeah, like I wouldn't care that you post vlogs all month instead of a ton of beauty videos, um, my hair is annoying me, then I'll totally do it next year or maybe even start late in this year if you guys really want. I can try. Um, 
So yeah, let me know. I think I forgot to tell you guys, but I've been using this SEO shower aromatherapy kit and you just attach it to the top of your shower head and you put one of these little aromatherapy pods connect it to the tip and then the oil releases like the essential oil releases um, onto the water while you're showering and it's very relaxing and the organic essential oils um, this was sent to me but I think it's a really cool concept and that's why I wanted to show you guys I was gonna put it in like a favorites or something but I thought I'd just talk about it on my vlog if you guys are interested I will link it down below um, yeah these are the three that I have breathe passion and unwind I've only used the unwind and I've used it for about two, almost, I think three showers. But it says each pod can last three to five showers each. So I really like it. I think it's very different. And the reason I wanted to mention it now is because I think it would be a pretty cool, like unique Christmas present. Even like one of those, um, what is it called? White elephant gifts. I think that would be a cool idea. So I wanted to share that with you guys now. Hey guys, so I just filmed my November favorites. Probably dark in here. Um, I didn't go over my eye makeup, but everything I'm wearing is in my November favorites. So go watch that. And it has all my makeup on it. I was wearing my cozy flannel from Fashion Nova. I don't even think I said where it was from. I'm going to have to link that on my channel. But FashionNova.com. It's so warm that I was pretty much sweating. Yeah, this is my bra. I'm not going to show you anything below this level. <laughs> um, I was so hot that I just had to like, take the flannel off right away. And I'm going to pin my hair up because I'm so flipping hot right now. I filmed in front of my tree, though, for my November favorites. And I hope it comes out really good. And if it does, I might just keep filming in my living room for just Christmas time. Um, and this eye is kind of like an emeralds green eye. It's a L'Oreal Infallible Shadow in Gilded Envy all over the lid, and then the other colors are Makeup Geek. I said I wasn't going to go over it, but look at me. I'm already doing it. And Lorac Luster Drops because I'm obsessed with them right now. And it was raining all morning. I think I'm going to just try to edit a little bit, and I might go see Mama B. I don't know. She's feeling way better, by the way. Um, swelling has gone, da gone down. She went to the dentist the other day and had her root canal and she's doing way better. So thank you guys for all your positive thoughts and prayers and that's it for now. I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, we're at TJ Maxx and they have Kate Spade here. Look at these beautiful ones. And there's these little wristlets that are Kate Spade. Maybe she gives Janice this little coach bag. Um, I don't think she would wear it. Well, she could put her, like if she's going shopping, you just put your phone in here. There's slots for... So I went grocery shopping. I'm going to show you what I got. And I also went to TJ Maxx with Mama B. I had to return those curtains. And I did get a few presents that I'm going to show you. So first off, I got five Lean Cuisines. The pizzas and the ravioli are my favorite. I don't like the ones with the meat. They're gross. Um, it was five for $10. I got some popcorn because I've been wanting popcorn really bad. And this one from Orville is only 100 calories. It's like the mini bags. And then I got some Eggos. These are the whole grain made with eight grams, grams of whole grain. I've had these before. I couldn't find the other brand that I really like that um, is like all natural. But I was only at a regular fries. I was like a regular grocery store. I wasn't at Whole Foods. So um, anyways, these are I think 120 calories. No, 170 for two waffles. And then this I've never tried. It's the Oat Revolution Steel Cut Instant Oatmeal with flaxseed, and it's 170 calories for one, but it's supposed to have way more program, program, <laughs> way more protein and omega threes. This one's the maple brown sugar flavor, so we'll see if I end up liking that. Um, and it was on sale, so that's why I got it. <laughs> then I got some sandwich thins. They're 100 calories. I love these for sandwiches during the week. You know, things like that. I got some carrots, some baby carrots. These are grown here in Arizona, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, I got some cheese on sale, the Mexican style. I use this in my eggs a lot. And I got some Simply True Organic 50-50 blend. This has spinach and spring mix. This was on sale as well. And it's already ready to go, which I love. I need fast and simple. 
I got some hummus. I've never tried this brand or this flavor, but it sounded amazing. Spicy three pepper. So we'll see if I like that. Um, yogurt was three for something, so I got three. I've never tried this one. It's the one with steel cut oats in it. It's apple. And then I got two of the coconut because that's my favorite. And the berries were on sale for 99 cents. So I got two packs of raspberries. Also, It Cosmetics sent me their new brow product. Exciting. I think this comes out in February. It's called Build a Brow. It comes in five different colors. Very reminiscent of the um, brow pomades from Anastasia. I got the color dark brown. Looks like that. Really nice packaging though. And then they also sent me the dual sided brush which I'm excited for. So yay, thank you at Cosmetics, excited for that. Okay, now this is all that I got at TJ Maxx. Not really a lot. So I love this makeup bag, isn't it so cute? I'm giving it as a gift, but I totally want it. <laughs> um, it's by the brand Danielle Creations. It's lined really nicely too, and it has studs all the way around. Um, it also came in white, but I decided to get the black because I felt like the white would get dirty. And it has this little handle. And I'm this is for my stepmom, and I'm also giving her this is her favorite lotion. So I got it for her, the Scottish Fine Soaps Collection, body butter. And then I found this. She's never tried this, I don't think, but it's the body wash from the same company in lavender and lilac. And so I'm gonna put those inside this bag. I'm also gonna give her one or two makeup items as well. And I got this cute little pouch, it says happy, and it's gold. It was three bucks, and I thought this would be a cute little um, gift to put a gift card in as well. I don't know who I'm giving it to right now, but I thought it was really cute and I couldn't pass it up. And I think I showed you, there was a ton of Kate Spade, um, a lot of these cute little bags, so many cute, cute things. Um, and they also had Andalou Naturals products there, so. Anyways, go to TJ Maxx. <laughs> I also got my grandma this Chi Keratin conditioner and shampoo because she's been wanting some good quality um, shampoo and conditioner and it's already in this box so I'm about to wrap it. <laughs> and that's all I got at TJ Maxx. So I'm editing my favorites and then this comes on. <laughs> oh, you guys have no idea how much I love Minions. <laughs> Good morning. It's super, super early, but I'm off to work in a second. This week we have to do a purple kind of cut crease look with a nude lip which I am happy about the nude lip. Um, that's a little off. Um, my nude lip is the It Cosmetics Medium Nude. No, that's not what it is. Um, it's the Nude Light Medium Lip Liner. And then I have the Hourglass Grace lipstick on. A little bit of NARS Raquel Audacious lipstick. Very little, though. Um... I'm not going to go over everything, I'm so sorry, because I'm running out of time, but the cut crease, the whole eye is the Wonder Vision palette from Smashbox, and I just did purple cut crease with a pencil brush, and then a lighter nude shade all over the lid. Um, my blush today is from the Hourglass palette, and it's in the shade Incandescent Electra, it's the limited edition shade that's in the center right there. And then bronzer is Too Faced Chocolate Soleil. The highlight and setting powder was from the Hourglass Ambient Powder Palette. And what else did I use? Um, I used the Hourglass, a lot of Hourglass today. Um, Illusion Foundation. I'm in the shade Warm Ivory. And that's pretty much it. I have my Francesca's headband on. And I'm going to go get my jewelry and my outfit on for work. And I'll see you guys later.